Hey, MC back here again. Doing a follow up to the bench test safe handling of firearms with wearing mittens. So this is the field portion of the test where we put on our mittens. We have on our safety glasses. We are at a range and we're going to see if we can in cold weather uh, load and cycle our firearms wearing mittens. So this one is the GSG 22 long rifle, unloaded, magazine is not installed. Uh, this one is a single action only, so it's a 1911 clone, runs on 22 long rifle. Let's load it up and see what our results are going to be. If the magazine didn't fall to the bottom of our pockets, but hey, that's I guess a good test. To see if we can retrieve a magazine from our front jeans pocket, keeping our pistol pointed in a safe direction while wearing mittens. So let's give it a go. Uh, safe backstop. We're on a private range. Magazine uh, loaded. Got around the chamber. Safety is off. Let's try a few rounds. Oh, and we had a stovepipe. So let's see if we can clear this jam. Drop the magazine. We'll see if that round, uh, yeah. So another round chambered, but I couldn't tell if that was a spent round or a loaded round. So we'll take a shot. Hmm. Okay, so I do have a round in the chamber, but it failed to extract. So let me drop the magazine. There still are about four bullets left in this. And that was a live round. And we caught it wearing mittens. So gun is clear. Safety is back on. Let's load this round in our magazine. So again, wearing mittens, got the round back in the magazine, let's try to run the rest of them. And our magazine is empty, chamber is clear. Magazine removed, action closed. So it looks like we can cycle a 1911, at least the rimfire version, um, the GSG using mittens. As long as we're here, let's try our Ruger SR-22. This one is unloaded as well. This one is the single action, double action. And we had a little trouble running the double action wearing the mittens as I didn't have enough um, material in the mitten to be able to pull the gun back in double action. So let's load this up and see if we can run 10 rounds through this platform. Okay, magazine in went, went in well. Chamber closed. Let's try it double action. Oh, safety. I gotta put that in the fire position. Again, this Ruger SR22 is backwards in my opinion on the safety. Oh, double action just doesn't get it back far enough. So let's cycle it to single action and see what we get. Let's 
Okay. Decocker. Uh, one thing I did notice is your trigger release. When you pull the trigger, you really can't feel it. And so you have to intentionally release your finger with your mitten material to get the trigger to reset so you can do a follow-up shot. Uh, back in the fire position, back into single action again. Magazine is empty. So we can run the Ruger SR-22 not in double action, but at least in single action, it is possible, wearing your mittens, to safely, with practice, cycle 22 rimfire semi-automatic. So again, be safe. Um, practice in a safe location. Uh, anything unknown to you, figure out the mechanics, how it's going to work in the field, without any ammunition, practice safe, understand how things work, and then prove it out in the field with live ammunition under controlled circumstances in, um, in a controlled area. So thank you for watching. Uh, leave a comment. Uh, come visit Michigan if you get a chance too. We've got awesome tourist stuff, some of the greatest beaches in the country or the world for that matter. And West Michigan in general with Grand Rapids is Beer City, USA. So if you like micro brews, this is the place for you. Thanks for watching.